The annual Texas Tech Carol of Lights is about a month away, and workers have already begun the process of hanging the 25,000 red, white, and orange lights. Carol of Lights advisor Craig Cunart says planning the event is made easier since much of what is done has stayed the same throughout the years. Carol of Lights is a really interesting event to work with and the fact that it's been around for so long and it's a really big tradition, lots of stuff goes into it, but a lot of it's already established and consistent from year to year. Carol of Lights advisor Alice Scott has been working on the event for 23 years and says it has gained popularity in other universities as well. I have had in the past a lot of universities have contacted us because they want to know how we do this, how much it costs, blah, 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 you know, things right. like that. RHA President Jesse Saldivar says the Carol of Lights is one of the largest events RHA conducts and thus needs a larger budget. We are um, given $5 per student every semester, so I think we have about $35,000 per semester. Um, and we allocate that money accordingly based on the different programs we do through the semester. This year's Carol of Lights will be held on December 9th, and the lights will run until the start of the new year. For the Daily Toriador, I'm Edmund Rostrand.